this word is nursed. Let's say that word together. Nursed. Nursed means took care of a sick person. This word is capture. Let's say that together. Capture. Capture is taking someone and not letting them leave. Harriet Tubman, Follow the North Star. Written by Violet Finley. Illustrated by Marcy Ramsey. Harriet Tubman stood just five feet tall. She could not read or write. Even so, she helped hundreds of African Americans lead lives of freedom. Let's learn about this amazing woman. Harriet Tubman lived from about 1820 to 1913. Who all in Harriet's family were slaves? Harriet Tubman was born around 1820 in Maryland. In those days, some people in the South had slaves. Harriet was a slave. So were her parents, brothers, and sisters. Harriet did not know the year she was born. Slaves' birthdays were not written down. What kind of things did slaves have to do? Slaves were owned by white masters. They had to cook, work on farms, and do whatever their masters said. Slaves were not paid. They could also be sold away from their families at any time. People were taken from their homes in Africa. They were forced to be slaves in America. This was wrong. Where was Harriet's family cabin? Little Harriet and her family lived in a log cabin with a dirt floor. Their tiny home was on the land of their master's big farm. As a child, Harriet only had one dress and no shoes. What kinds of work did Harriet have to do? Harriet never went to school. Instead, she worked like a grown-up. She cared for a white family's baby and cleaned their house. Later, she worked in the fields, carried water, and chopped wood. Harriet was very strong. What happened to Harriet? One morning, a slave ran away. A white man threw a heavy object at the slave to stop him. Harriet was in the way, and it hit her on the head. She was badly hurt and became very sick. What did Harriet decide to do? Harriet's mom nursed her back to health, but Harriet was left with a huge scar on her head. The experience made Harriet decide that someday she would run away too. Harriet was sick for a long time. Why did Harriet head to the northern states? That day came in 1849. As the sky grew dark, no one saw Harriet sneak into the woods. She headed to the northern states, where there was no slavery. Harriet followed the bright north star. It showed her the way to the northern states. What kind of things did the Underground Railroad do to help? The Underground Railroad helped Harriet along the way. This was not a railroad with trains. It was a way that slaves ran away to freedom. People secretly hid the slaves, gave them food, and told them which way to go. Sometimes slaves hid in houses as they traveled on the Underground Railroad. Do you remember what city Harriet made it to? The trip was long, cold, and dangerous. The woods were very scary, but brave Harriet made it all the way to Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. This map shows where Harriet traveled. Harriet had finally reached the North. She was free. At last, nobody owned her. Nobody could tell her what to do. What did Harriet use her money for? Harriet got a job in a hotel. She used the money she made to help other slaves run away. 
During her life, she made many trips down south. She led more than 300 people to freedom in the north. Slave owners offered a lot of money to capture Harriet, but she never got caught. I was a conductor on the Underground Railroad for eight years, she said, and I never lost a passenger. People who escaped on the Underground Railroad were called passengers. People like Harriet, who helped slaves travel on the Underground Railroad, were called conductors. How did Harriet fight in other ways? Harriet fought slavery in other ways, too. During the Civil War, she helped the North by spying on the South. She also worked as a nurse. Harriet cared for soldiers hurt in the war. What was Harriet's biggest dream? In 1865, Harriet's biggest dream came true. Slavery finally ended. Harriet died at the age of about 93, but her heroic spirit still burns as bright as the North Star. Let's say this word together. Nursed. Nurse means took care of a sick person. On this page of our book, it tells us that Harriet's mom nursed her back to health. That means she took care of her. We could use the word nursed another way. We could say, the mom nursed her baby back to health when she was sick. Let's say this word together, capture. Capture is taking someone and not letting them leave. On this page of our book, it tells us that slave owners offered a lot of money to capture Harriet or to catch her. We could use the word capture another way. We could say, I use my net to capture a few butterflies. 